If you remember the challenging case 12, the 70 years old female was brought to me with complaints of headache and sudden degrees of vision in the right eye. When I examined her vision was 660 in the right eye and intraocular pressure was 14 mm of mercury. There were early lenticular changes, a sluggish reactive pupil and I showed the fundus to the viewers and most of the viewers were spot on that it's the central retinal vein occlusion with lot of peripapillary hemorrhages, exudates and cotton wool spots. But what is the cause of this central retinal vein occlusion? Well, a um, lot of viewers were also correct. Uh, they mentioned um, severe hypertensive retinopathy. When I checked her blood pressure, it was 210 by 130. So she had uncontrolled malignant hypertension that lead to vein occlusion in the right eye along with headaches. So I straight away referred her to the physician for emergent uh, BP management to decrease the risk of developing heart, renal, cardiac and uh, failure, stroke and permanent visual loss. So, but uh, one thing uh, I should mention that the uh, uh, blood pressure should be lowered in a controlled manner, manner and not rapidly to prevent further ischemic damage to the target and organs. Initial treatment is uh, systemic uh, antihypertensives uh, followed by oral agents and goal is to reach the systolic uh, blood pressure up to 130 to 1 millimeter of mercury and diastolic to 80 to 90 in a couple of weeks. So I hope uh, that uh, the mystery is now clear and uh, the patient uh, those who said that uh, the patient is having uh, central retinal vein occlusion uh, they are very right and one of the most common the two most common causes of central retinal vein occlusion are glaucoma and hypertension hypertension is the most common cause so whenever you get a picture of uh, crvo you should check bp and bp was the cause in this case thank you very much